teacher Jessa. Guys, hello. So, uh, I share ko lang yung experience ko in applying in ESL online teaching company. So, my first application is in 5-1 Talked. So, um, what happened in 5-1 Talk? Actually, nakapasa ako sa interview. Interview. <laughs> so, I have to correct my pronunciation because this is my new career. Hindi pala new kasi kasi andyan pa yung old ko. <laughs> so, this is my additional job, part-time job para makasurvive tayo sa pandemic. So, share ko lang. So, on the first day of my application, in-interview kami through Skype. And, yes, I passed. But, hindi lahat nakakapasa, guys. So, you have to be conscious with your pronunciation. So, you are also lively. Siyempre, when in the interview, when you are in the interview, you are going to position in your teaching space. Kasi tinitingnan na nila yan. Okay? And then, ayun na, after nung interview ko, actually, madami kaming in-interview nun, so it's a peer interview. So, yun. Nakapasa tayo, and then next, the next day, I think hindi siya the next day kasi dinelay ko pa yung schedule ko ng next uh, step for ano, application kasi parang hindi pa ako decided sa 5-1 talk. So, yun, medyo dinelay ko siya parang mga 3 days kasi ang kasunod na nun ay system check. So, I have to be ready with my lighting, my background, my teaching space, and my LAN cable kasi the LAN cable is required. Pero, I just, kala ko lang din, required talaga siya. Pero, no mismo interview na, tinanong lang kung may LAN cable daw ba yung aking uh, laptop. Kung connected siya. At that moment, kung connected siya sa Wi-Fi. Tapos, sabi ko, yes. But then again, pwede naman palang hindi, hindi, hindi mo na i-require yung sarili mo na bumili ng LAN cable. So, anyway, mura lang naman yung LAN cable. Yung mga 10 meters na LAN cable, it's just 150 pesos. So, yun. At least, meron na ako, ba Tapos, ang kasunod na nangyari is, yun na, nakapasa pa rin ako sa sa system check kasi ang chine-check lang naman nila yung speed ng internet connection mo. Yun lang. So, yun. Should be 5 Mbps. Yun yung requirement nila. Sinasabi lang nila na 3 Mbps pero yung sa mismong process na it's 5 Mbps. So, yun. Makapasa pa rin tayo. And then, the next step is the pre-service training. So, in the pre-service training, I will I am scheduled on June 13. So, yun. Daming kailangan. Dapat may submit na namin yung mga requirements like government ID, um, what else? Hmm. NBI, so, yun, diploma, and to buy the picture. And also, you should all, you should prepare your self-introductory, or self-introduction, introductory. So, hanggang dun pa lang ako sa, sa pre-service training, and it will be on June 13th. But as of now, guys, I am I am also applying in Native Camp. Kasi, based on my reviews, mas mataas yung um, starting rate nila. So, yun. Sana makapasa. Pero, nandun na ako sa pangalawa sa huling step.
sa demo lesson na ako. So, kwento ko lang sa inyo yung nangyari sa native camp. So, on the first day, this is my third day na sa native camp in applying. So, in my first day, I just registered in their um, website. So, you should register, uh, create an account, and then, yun na, mapupunta ka na dun sa portal nila and what I did is that I just input my information so after that system check na agad so wala kang kukontakin na kung sino-sino at sa 512 ang dami na bawat step mayroong naka-assign na uh, staff para i-accommodate ka dito sa sa native camp you just wait and wait, and wait. Okay? So, pagka kinulik mo na yung system check nila, ibig sabihin, mag-wait ka para meron, para meron pumasok sa iyo na men, na magsi-system check sa iyo. Okay? Then, next one is, so, ang ginawa namin, ginawa ko pala yan ay naghintay ako guys so di kinlik ko na yung system check but there's no ava available schedule so yung system check na dapat sa day 1 ay napunta sa day 2 so yun so when I open around 9am when I open my application bigla akong napapasok sa queue so, dun. Number almost 300 ako. Yan. So, I waited for like almost an hour para ako na yung maging in number one spot at ako na yung system check. And I was surprised kasi akala ko mahirap. Sobrang dali lang guys. So, huwag kayong maging nega. Sobrang dali lang. So, sa system check, they just asked me, are you connected to a LAN or you are using your Wi-Fi? Yun lang. Sabi ko, I'm using my Wi-Fi, but I also have a LAN connection. So, there. After the, uh, tapos, in the middle of the system check, they asked me kung saan ako nakatira at saka, ano yung mga work experience ko. So, syempre, dapat sa pagsagot nyo guys, you should be lively para wala nang maraming itarang sa inyo. So, yun yung tip ko. Kasi after nun, hindi na ako tinanong kung ano-ano. Sabi niya lang, nakapasa daw ako dun sa system check, ganyan-ganyan. So, yun. So, siguro tinatest lang din yung ano ba tawag dito? Yung confidence mo sa pag in speaking English. So, yun. Next is this one na. Ah, no. The learning kit. So, when you pass the system check, you will go to the learning kit. You are going to study the demo lesson. So, you're just going to watch videos. There are three videos with three different lessons. So, watch your own and you will do it in the demo. So, yun. Nag-study na nga ako ngayon. Bukahapon, nag-learning uh, kit ako. So, after ng learning kit, I proceed to the demo. But there is no schedule na nangyari. At meron pa nga nangyari na hindi pa ako nakakapag-demo. Tapos, nag nakita ko na agad dun sa screen ko na yung button na start a demo, naging siyang retake demo. Which is, di pa naman ako nakakapag-demo. So, ayun. But, wag nyo na lang pansinin. Okay lang yun. Yan. Tapos, so, I just checked the schedule. So, yun. Nakapasok ako sa demo. Pero, na-disappoint ako nung may... Actually, naghintay ako ng mga almost two and a half hours bago ako wag yung third ko. So, I was disappointed kasi ang sabi lang nila doon, akala ko magde-demo na ako. Pinamemorize lang sa akin yung pinasa nilang script. Pala, yan lang pala yung napala ako sa loob ng almost two and a half hours of waiting. So, 
sabi nila i memorize ko daw and then if i already memorized it i will go back to them i will call them so ayun yun lang and then ngayon i am waiting for them again to proceed on the last step which is the demo lesson and after this you are going to go to the account information doon nila ibibigay sa inyo lahat lahat na gagawin nyo and yung mga instruction syempre pag nandun ako tangkap na ako so yun so hopefully matanggap ako yun, yun lang naman guys so thank you for watching